Hello everybody, I'm Oliver and welcome to The Road to Glory. This is episode number 9 and today we're still in the Bronze Cup. We need one more Bronze Challenge win to uh, unlock Division 5, so pretty exciting stuff. Now, in the last episode we won the first game in the round of 16, so we're through to the quarterfinals yet again as we open some silver packs. Look at this, I get 6 silver contracts so that's my money back guaranteed along with some fitness card and morale card so good stuff there i go with my english team and uh, with a bit of a korean league influence there on the left wing against this pretty much mls team with yeah I'm a last team with a bit of English strike force and some good players there up front now well. he gets the first chance of the game a long shot two. which a my keeper just, just parries and then grab and breaks through and does that and little chip. cheeky chip and scores the first goal of the game now he was this player was uh, well, he was better than me in this game, for sure. He throws up something out of this game. I get a chance here, but don't take it really well. And he, in the 37th minute, makes a triple substitution. And almost straight after that, a long pass for Paulo. Mistake by the defender, and Paulo finishes it into the corner in the 39th minute. Two minutes after that, triple substitution. So, one all at the break, and here Paulo breaks through, passes to Kim Dong Suk, who finishes it for the 2 1 goal. Now, this was a bit against the run of play, but I took it. He got some chances here, some half chances, some chances, but never on goal, really. And that was it for this game. So, we're through to the semis once again. Good stuff. Paulo with a man of the match. Uh, I think it's his third man of the match, which puts him at top. Now, we're not buying packs in between matches as much, so I want to save up some money. So our semi-final match, we come up against this team. A very solid team, as you can see. Stri the uh, right wing and right left wing and the strikers. Very pacey indeed. No, not the striker. He's very strong. Not pacey. Paulo scores the first goal, and that was very much against the run of play. He was dominating me in this game. Left and right. You, see, you can see that half time match stats had one shot and like 44% possession. And I couldn't handle the pace of Mr. Weston there. Who scores the equalizer in the 55th minute? I just couldn't handle him in this game. But take nothing away from this particular FIFA player. He was better than me. Straight up. And here the second goal. A bit. Yeah. Maybe the keeper could have done better there. But a strong striker. Scores it. This was my second chance of the game, and I didn't get any nearer than that. So finally, we lost. I think it's like first loss in seven games. So we had a pretty good streak there, but it ended just like that. And I didn't deserve anything out of this game. He was much better than me. So props to him. A very good player indeed. Now. I sold stuff from my packs. I got my money back from those silver packs from earlier. So we went ahead and bought another silver pack and we get a Danish striker there that we might use. I still always get some contracts and fitness cards so I can always make something out of these packs. Sell some contracts and get some money back. 
And here we get a Dutch striker that I'm really excited about, mainly because of his pace, of course. But as you know, pace is very important in this game. So to the round of 16, we go again against a, well, not a starter pack team. He's got like a boosted defense and all rares. And he was much better than me in the beginning of this game. A wonderful pass. But and my the German head. goalkeeper, also that was the he hero the from the previous he episode, the he was still on fire. Now he gets a penalty around the 20th minute. Oh, Kittner concedes the penalty. Smith steps up and goes wonderful straight pass. up the middle, well, but for sure the German keeper well. saves it for the first penalty save of this series. Oh, now, I had a new center forward, goal! an Italian and called uh, Bonnie Perti on his debut. And he scored there a good goal, a good header. Here. And now a great attack from me. This is a young attack. Austrian like player on the uh, center attacking mid. So Leaves it for Bonnie Perti and he just oh, places it in the corner, good top good corner. Pass. Second goal of the game. Now. He got his chances, of course, but my keeper was always ahead of the game. And Katha breaks through, rolls it, gets a bit lucky there, but still finishes 3-0. And here is probably the best save of the game. I don't know how he gets that. Let's watch a slow replay of this again. Look how quick he goes down, man. He's just... I've been amazing for me, this keeper. Again, there, in the second half. He just saves everything, it seems. And here, a bit of... A good play from Sugar. Sent to Webster and Wokaj, the new center defensive mid, with a great finish. A great volley. And here again, my keeper... On his toes. Saving everything that comes at him. Very good indeed. He's now Bonnie Purdy, the Italian, scores his oh, first hat trick on. Well, of course, his first hat trick is his debut after all. And then Ancatha, keeper in a bit of a mess, and we scored the sixth goal of the game. Now Bonnie Purdy finishes with a hat trick. This is the second player that scores a hat trick in the series. This is a um, for them. Bilal has got two of them. The now Berger gets the man of the match. Amazing the performance, like I said before. Well, thank you he had like uh, what, nine saves. I showed you five saves, I think. Time. Very good saves. If you if you did catch the last episode, many good saves in the final there. He won us the tournament, like I said. Just, I couldn't recommend it enough, this guy. Now we open up a silver pack. Uh, and I have a lot of center backs in silver. Just a team full of center backs. Get another center back there. And I go ahead and open up a bronze pack. Just to... Uh, get like profit from it really I don't need more bronze players I feel like I can beat the bronze challenge once more with my players available so that's that now on to the corner of stats everybody here you can see some team stats and some player stats I put together after every single episode now Bilal is still on the top of the list although not playing in this episode in goal scored Kittner has the most matches and Katha with the most assists and the man of the match hero is Apollo with three. Now Nico Burchard is our featured player. He has only played three games but still managed to pull off 29 saves. That's almost a ratio of 10 saves per game. He's conceded three goals and man of the match two times and one penalty save. So only 54 overall rated, a great player overall. Now, 
I'm looking forward to the next episode. I've been Oliver. Take care, everybody.